Oh yeah! Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's video, I am going to teach you how to achieve the dark and moody effect using the Visco app. So first, let us look for a presets. So there are a lot of presets around here. So I'm just going to look for the one that looks dark and faded to achieve our dark and moody effects. There, we can try this one. Also try that one, 05. Um, so black and white, that looks good also, but I don't want for this photo to look black and white. So for this photo, I choose 05. Yes, it looks perfect for me. And now we need to adjust the exposure. So if you want a dark and moody effects, we must decrease the exposure. So as you can see, it looked dark now. So decrease to negative negative two um negative two point two. Now move to contrast. So I want the contrast for this one to be increased. So let's increase the contrast to one point three. So that's okay. Now let's move to sharpen. So if if you increase the sharpen, it will look it would make your photo um. The detail would be clearer, so we must increase the sharpen. Next for the clarity, so if you increase this would look like so just add a little bit of clarity. Add plus seven and then move to saturation. So for the moody effects we must decrease the saturation. There, so it would look dark. So decrease to negative zero point nine. And then for the highlights, just increase a little bit. There. So 3.1, then for the shadows, um, just increase to 5. So that's okay now. Now for the white balance, for the for the moody effect, the temperature must be low. So decrease to negative 2.3, um, negative, negative 1.8. And then for the tint, to the right side because it would look um, pink there. And now for the skin tone, so the left side will make your photo yellow, orange, or red. The right side is yellow, so just increase, uh, decrease to negative 5. For the grain, add a little bit of grain so that it will look Instagrammable. For the split tone, so I use blue so that it will look cooler. Now if it's moody, it must be cooler. The temperature must be low there. So just decrease um, plus 1.2. And then let's move to HSL. So move the red first. Uh, just adjust. It would only affect the, the color of the skin. Same with orange. There. Just adjust a little bit. And then move to yellow. Also move to the left side so that it would look pink there. And then decrease the saturation a little bit. And for the green, for the leaves, we must turn the leaves into yellow and then decrease the saturation so that it would look darker. So you can see there's a big difference. Now for the blue, I want to I want to remove all the blue color, so decrease the saturation to zero. And then purple does not help actually. And then we have now our final for final product. There, there's a big difference from light to dark and moody. So as you can see, it can really make your photo look great. So I suggest you download the Visco app now if you want to achieve these kind of photos. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you like this video. Click the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye bye. Hee 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 hee. Friday morning.